I think public, and life, uh, public engagement is important uh, in connection to science and innovation because it can help align the expectations and the needs of society with what uh, science and innovation can do. It, uh, it aligns, you could say, the problems with the solutions so that we, uh, so we don't have a society which has a lot of problems and then we have research with what is doing just something unconnected, but that begins to be a connection between the two. Well, the role of civil society in research and innovation is of crucial importance, I think. Uh, it is important in order to ground research and innovation better in society, in that it responds to societal needs and concerns, and take this into account in respective developments. As such, civil society can provide a kind of a reality check for research and innovation and helps directing these attempts back to society and that it's uh, a better match grounding it in society, embedding it in society and making research and innovation relevant. I think there are certainly parts of science or certainly parts of um, the scientific community and the research community that are very willing to uh, engage with uh, society in a different way, in a more responsible way. Um, but I think it's important for us to try and alert them as to how they can actually do that. Because I think a lot of people are willing to do, uh, to change the way in which they behave with society, but they don't really know how.